Hi everyone, Aaron here for Zolo Tech, and today Apple released iOS 10.3.2 Beta 2. This came in at 126 megabytes for me. Now this could vary depending on which version of device you have. This is an iPhone 7 Plus, so uh, this one was 126 megabytes. Let's take a look at the version number. You'll see the version is 14F5075A. And with these betas, Apple has really made the version numbers a lot longer than they used to be. So that's kind of how you know they're beta at this point. Now, the last beta, beta one, was pretty buggy for me. When I was going back and forth like this, it was fine, but then it would actually freeze up for me and stop working properly. So sometimes I'd have to hard reboot it, hold this button in the volume down in a 7 Plus or the home button on another device. This would completely lock up and freeze. I wasn't able to do anything. But other than that, battery life was solid and everything else worked fine for me. However, some people were having issues with VPN and in this particular beta, I've been told that it's fixed. So it should be working for you. People online are reporting that VPN is working fine in beta two and some people reported it works on 32 bit devices. However, I didn't see that in any of Apple's notes. Some people claim that it does. Some say that it doesn't. So if you have a 32 bit device, let us know in the comments below whether or not that works for you. Other than that, though, this is a bug update. This is a bug fix. It fixes a lot of things in the back end. Now, I did run a benchmark test on this, and I saved it in photos here. This is the last one. This is from March 28th, and you'll see it's 3336 for single core. It actually went down a little bit on this one to 3329. The multi-core went up, though, to 5963 from 5463, or 5453. So you'll see it went up a little bit. Now, the performance so far has been pretty solid. I haven't had any issues, anything like that. Everything seems nice and fast. Uh, everything's working okay, and I expect that. This is a revision of 10.3.1, and since then, it's been pretty stable, and people have been telling me that one's good. But beta 2 of 10.3.2 hopefully fixes most of those little bugs, and then we'll probably see a couple more betas, and then a final rollout, either in a few weeks to a month, month and a half. Now, iOS 11 should be shown in June, so we'll probably not see any new features, any dark modes, anything like that until June. I wouldn't expect any feature changes, just bug fixes at this point. Now, there were some issues in Apple's notes or an issue basically that said Siri text responses may not be complete. So maybe when it's responding via text or you're speaking via text, it won't be complete. And I haven't seen that yet, but that's a known issue and Apple's working on it. Also, SOS outside of India still doesn't work on iOS on this on these versions outside of India. So that was in some early versions of 10.2 in the betas, but it just doesn't work anymore. That allows you to click this button five times and have it dial an SOS signal, basically dial out to 911, things like that. So that's pretty much it for this beta. If you'd like to get your hands on this wallpaper, thanks to Connor for sending it along. I'll leave a link in the description below. If you'd like to send me your wallpaper for consideration, if I pick it, I'll give you a shout out as well. Please send it to me at Twitter. I'll leave my Twitter name at Zolotech here. There's other ways you can reach me as well, but Twitter seems to keep the higher resolution better. Or you can email me as well. Let us know your experiences with the last beta, beta 1, in the comments below. And if you've installed beta 2, let us know what you think about it here as well. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe and like. As always, thanks for watching. This is Aaron. I'll see you next time. <laughs>